What's up, YouTube? Just want to show you guys real quick how I installed my uh, pack springs. The whole kit I bought from J came with uh, pack springs, chromoly retainers, chromoly valve seats, and it came with number 6070 uh, shim, which sat on top of the uh, OEM shim. It also came with hardened push rods and the cam, obviously. The cam is a pro charger cam, so it doesn't chop. 205 by 226. Don't know the uh, exact numbers on the cam. All I know, it's a, kind of a stage one or a stage one and a half pro charger cam. So I deleted the DMDS, uh, replaced everything with Hellcat lifters. So pretty happy with the work I did on the parts received, quality parts compared to uh, kind of Mopar users. It's kind of scary to see that these things kind of fail uh, through time. I don't know if it's an oil change issue or maintenance issue, but I wanted to eliminate all those problems. If it's a quality uh, product issue with Mopar. Um, these Hemi's are pretty much very strong motors, but I wanted to just have a peace of mind having the best of the best um, installed. So I decided to do it myself, just not to save me money, but it was a challenge for me to try to do that. So thanks for watching. And uh, make sure you subscribe and follow. All right, YouTube, um, get the head installed. I use the um, ARP head bolts. The torque in sequence is 35, 70, 100 pounds with 28 pounds for the torque. Using the Queen Harbor Freight um, tool and my trustworthy Husky here to double check everything. So the way the head gaskets are put on is, this is the uh, left side, which is gonna be when you're facing it's going to be right side you're always going to sit behind the wheel to determine which left or right this is the left this is the right bay and uh now i'm about to torque down the uh rocker arms so we just got to make sure that everything here all the uh intakes and exhausts push rods are in the longer ones are exhaust the shorter ones are intake and also make sure that they all sitting on top of the valves um, seven pounds to slug them down, 17 pounds in initial torque, and um, 30 degrees. So I ended up getting this Queen Harbor Freight tool to uh, torque down to 30 degrees. And uh, the one thing you have to make sure, double make sure that all the intakes, push rods are all seated and properly Adjust it. All the rocker arms are sitting on top of the valves. I got them snug down with this uh, little guy here, and uh, the rest will be torqued down. So it's a one man show here. I apologize, I can't get you all the content. I also changed this pulleys to the um, gate, gate pulley, so I'm not breaking any plastics or anything like that. Oh, I'll hop back in and show you another video when I'm installing the uh, Pro Charger bracket here. Alright, thanks for watching.